One, two, three. One, two, three. Hey everybody, welcome back to Pokemon Platinum. Um, so, I don't think we can fight the gym leader just yet. So we're going to heal up. And we're going to go to the... What is it? The marsh pits or whatever. Like, they're equivalent to the safari zone. Um, we're going to go there and check that out. Because if I'm right... Huh. Well, hold on. There might be cool stuff in here anyway. Alright, let's go in. Um, I mean, there are cool stuff in here. So, we'll see what we can get. Okay, so I can't remember if it's Pokemon Battles or if it's like a Safari Zone thing. Okay, it's, it's just Safari Zone. Okay. I wouldn't mind having a Quagsire on the team. Well, not on the team, but in my life. All right, so, I'm trying to remember this. So, bait makes it more likely to stick around, but less likely to catch. Mud makes it more easier to catch, but more likely to run. So honestly, sometimes your best bet is to just like be like, whatever. I'm not. Um, I'm just gonna throw a poke. I'm just gonna throw balls at it. Cause what else are you gonna do? No. No. So I think I get surf in here or somewhere around here. Okay, crow gunk is what I actually want. Um. He might come with me to fight the gym leader. Because one, he's already a high level. Like, he's, he's 27. That's kind of even with everybody else. Um, and he's got dry skin. Which basically means, like, water type moves don't work on me. So I'm probably going to switch out uh, Porygon for him. Like, we'll see what, what moves he has. I'm just gonna catch everybody. This is where you go to, like, beef up your, uh, your Pokédex. Oh, come on. Let's see, he ran. Ooh! So these are cool because they're grass flying. And they can actually fly. So if you're ever like looking for like, oh, okay, so I'm a huge fan of dual typing. Like if I feel like if I had a gym, it would be like dual typing. Like that would be my theme. Uh, but like, like if you're like if you're trying to build the party and you're having a hard time because you only have six, like you only fit like obviously like six slots. It's like okay, dual typing is your best. So if you want a grass type, get this dude because it's grass and flying. So you can fly, and then you can also help take on like rock types and water types and stuff like that. You know, fighting psychic. That, those are just great. I can take on rock types. I can take on, you know, ghosts and all kinds of cool stuff. You know, it just that's how I like to think about these games. You know. So I'm really happy that the starters became dual typing. Because now I got water steel and fire fighting and all that stuff. 
Ooh, got a Pokeball. Oh, should I look to see where you get Surf? I mean, because I'm gonna need it. Where do I get Surf? Dawn Stone. Okay, I don't need that. Uh, surf location is. Okay, so I need to beat the gym leader. And. Um, Cynthia will give me a secret potion to get past the Psyducks north of the, whatever town. And then Cynthia's grandmother will give me surf. Okay. So we still have a little ways to go, but not really. Just get in here. I don't even want you that much. It's just you're here. I'm just filling up the Pokédex, just doing my thing. Get, get out of the, get out of the. Okay. All right. Ooh, that's cool too. Also, I really do like poison types. They are cool. I feel like they need more, of like a positive reputation, than just like being a bad guy's, like Pokemon, because they're awesome. All right, so I'm just gonna, okay, so apparently I don't get it in here. Um, I'm sure, I'm assuming I get something in here, but I'm not gonna be terribly worried about it now. Like, I know I'm gonna have to come back in here after I beat the gym leader, so I might as well wear out my time, catch some stuff, and then go fight the gym leader. I'm also gonna go get Krogonk and see what it has for moves. Give me something good. I'm still wondering if I'm ever gonna see a shiny in this game. Like, again, I haven't seen a shiny type Pokemon you know, other than like the red Gyarados um, in a, a very, very long time. And I don't count the red Gyarados because it's given to you. Come on, get in here. Is this the generation that Tangula evolves, or is that the next gen? Come on. Get in. It's just sitting there looking at me. Get in the damn Pokeball. Oh my god. Either leave, or get in the ball. There's a thing, how do we get to that? Oh look, another Tangula, great. Oh, look at that, okay. Perfect, 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 perfect. Boom. How do I get over there? 
All right, what do we got? Something good, something different, something new. Come on. I'm gonna look to see how many steps I have left. Okay, I don't want Tangulas anymore. Um, that's all it says. It says it's 13 balls. It doesn't tell me how many, how long I have left. Okay, well, I'm just gonna do this then. I'm gonna run back and forth until I see something cool. Or I'm gonna try to go up further. Ooh, a whooper. Go. Okay, bye. I wonder what Pokemon game I wanna play after this. Cause like, so I did just order a Nintendo Switch. I finally found some places that have them, um, and I ordered one, and it's actually supposed to get here today. And uh, it came with Breath of the Wild, so there might be some Breath of the Wild videos coming up after this. Um, but I'm wondering, like, do I want to keep with the theme of these style of Pokemon games, or do I want to try something newer? Like maybe I'll go get um, Sword and Shield and play one of those. Um, maybe I'll, um, I don't know, maybe I'll, I want to do like heart gold, soul silver, something like that. Um, I don't know, six, where, what is all this? Oh, no, I don't want to go back. All right, um, two, I don't know. Okay. So what's in here now? Hi, you look nice. Oh God, you fell in the water. Um, Oh, yeah, so I don't know, like, maybe I could do Heart Gold and Soul Silver, um, something like that. I kind of like to go back to Johto. I feel like that would be cool. Um, but, I mean, Sword and Shield is very popular. Everybody's playing it now, so, you know, it might do better. And then I could always do Sword, um, like, Gold and Silver later. I honestly just almost walked right off. Is my time almost up? How does this work? And I got a yellow shard. Okay. And then I got one of these. Um. So I don't know. We'll see what happens. I also don't, don't want to do like too many of like the same style of games in a row. Cause like, even though Pokemon is probably like top five favorite game ever for me. Um, I don't know, like I don't, I don't think I want to be a Pokemon channel. So even though most likely throughout the whole um, life of this channel, I will probably get to all the Pokemon games. Um, I do want other stuff. So like I'll probably also do um, Zelda games and Mario games and anything else out there I can get my hands on. Come on. All right, I think I'm just gonna retire and get out of here. Oh my God, it's a level 30. Oh, that's so cool. Get in here. Oh, come on! Don't run, I want you. Damn it. It was a level 30. Be another one. 
Oh, that's quite exciting. You know what would honestly be kind of cool? If at the entrance of safari zones and safari zone type places, if they gave you like a list of stuff that's in the zone. Like have there be on the front door, like a little poster you click on and there's just a giant list of everything that's in here. So you know, like it, it can even turn into like a game and give you like, oh, if you complete the whole list and catch everything, even like the Dratini that's floating around, then you get like a rare candy or something, you know, like that would be cool. Do that. No, go, go down. All right, level 30, we're catching it right now. Oh, yes. So this thing is cool. This thing evolves into a giant ass scorpion bug thing. It's awesome, and I love it. And I want one. It just, it's probably just not gonna be good on my team. Like, if I could have like a 10 team party, then that would be cool. Okay, I'm done. I'm out of here. Um, then I feel like that would be worth it. But as I'm going right now, I'm good. So, how many Pokemon did you catch in the Safari Zone? At least five? Yep, you've done that all right. That's cool. There's something. Matchup checker, what is that? It shows the ability of Pokemon to each other. Okay. That's interesting. Alright, let's go do the gym. Okay, so between Psy Guy and Jolteon. Oh wait, hold on. Uh between yeah, between Psy Guy and Jolteon, I think we're good. But I'm gonna go grab. Excuse, excuse you. Um, move. Let me let me look. Hang on. Oh, it doesn't even have. This one doesn't even have dry skin. What is it? What do you? Hold on. What do you have? Battle armor. The Pokemon is protected against critical hits. Uh, toxic spike. Pin missile. Okay, toxic spike alone might be good. Hang on. What? Okay, so you're level 20. What moves do you know? Because you're a grass type. Razor Leaf, Stomp, Sweet Scent, and Whirlwind. Um, I mean, what moves do you... Put it down. What moves do you know? Mega Drain, Vine Whip, Poison Powder. Ooh, yeah, Tangula is going to be better for now. Okay, because I know somebody in there is going to have a Quagsire, so Grass types, because I could always get Rotan back out, but I feel like Grass types would be better. All right, I got 20 minutes into this, let's do it. I just remembered how much of a pain in the ass this place is. Okay, so I have to drain, let's go fight him, we're fighting everybody, because we're definitely under leveled here. Like, we might have type advantages, but we're under leveled. And some wa so a lot of these water types are beefy. Like if anybody has a like Polyrath or anything like that, we might be in trouble. I mean, Gyarados has a lot of HP, so you know somebody in here is gonna have a Gyarados. Um. Oh crap. Um. Yeah, not. Yeah, we're gonna play it. We're gonna try to be safe and smart. 
Thank you. Alright, so let's go down. Go up. Go here. You can fight me. Okay. I don't remember. Yep. Crap. Okay, so it's water ground. Um, let's test out our new guy. Leaf Blade. I was gonna say, like that went very slow, but, oh, we're good. I think off camera I might do some underground stuff um, to try to get more um, uh, hard scales. Okay, love cookies are status effects. Here, have a water. I don't know why I bought that. Um, this one. Then I can come across. Okay. So then I can come across here and fight you. And then, at the very least, I want to try to get to the gym leader by the end of this episode. And then um, maybe the next episode we'll fight him and then move on. Shockwave, how are you faster than I am? I know it's a quick attack and it has priority, but come on. I'm a Jolteon. Like, it doesn't get a lot faster than me when it comes to, like, non-legendaries. Like, I think it's, like, when it comes to non-legendaries, I honestly think it's something like, um... I don't know. Like, Alakazam, Electro... Jolteon, something like that. Electrode's surprisingly quick, but um, it doesn't get have a lot of good like moves. I don't remember what it takes to evolve to get a an Electrode. Um, like is it a Thunderstone or do you just give it to get it to like a certain level? I don't remember. Now we're up here. I'm gonna fight this girl. Three. Uh, oh, God, it's a level 27. Shockwave. And Azumarill! This is the third one of Meryl, because that would be cool. Does, I think Azumarill at some point turns into a, um, a fairy type, I believe. Aqua Ring heals. Shockwave. Bam. Okay, so when we're okay, so here's what we're gonna do. When we're done in this gym, we should be able to use Surf once we get it. Um, so when we're done here and doing all the bullshit in this town, um, we will go um. We'll go to the Windworks, go get Thunderbolt, and then we'll go to 
um, uh, the ironworks and get magma. I feel like that's good. And then once we, our team is actually complete and we can start like focusing on leveling up everybody needs to, um, and then we'll go from there. Cause the next gym after this, I think is a steel type gym. So we definitely met, need Magmar and we need him to be like on his game. Cause steel types aren't anything to mess around with. And if I could get, um, Psy guy to learn like a, a good fighting type move that isn't brick break or that isn't um, a rock smash like if I can find brick break or something or close combat or something like that'd be good <clears throat> I think I learned something at 31 don't I no okay when does Jolteon learn things Shockwave. Oh my god, that's so good. That is so good. Because his water, Gyarados is water flying. So it was like, what, four times effective or something? I'm, I'm, trying, to, I'm trying to remember all this. So it's something like... Regular water versus electric is, um, or electric ver on regular water is like two times effective, but if it's like water flying, it's four, something like that. Shockwave, I'll give it an ether and replace its PP and then go right to the gym leader. Unless there's other people to fight in here, then I'll do the gym leader next time. 32! Yeah, Jolteon's now officially my strongest guy. Okay, bag. Um, PP up. What did I just up it to? Um, was it 24 instead of 20? Something like that, but that's at 11 now. Okay, I'm gonna give it an ether because I really don't want to leave. Whatever, I'll find more. Sh shit! Wrong, okay, wasting them now. Who cares? So I gave it to, to the wrong thing. It. That's a uh, that's a trap. Okay, now I go back up here, and then I go down, and then I go over here, and then I go up here, and I fight this guy, and then I hit that blue button, and then I'm at the gym leader. So after this guy, I'll call it an episode. We'll fight the gym leader next time, and figure out what we're doing from there. Shockwave. And that's done. How many did he have? Three. Great. Uh huh. Uh huh. Shockwave. You guys are just lucky I don't have Thunderbolt right now. Come on. At least you use Rain Dance and not something that actually hurt me. Because I'm just going to sit here and do a quick attack. Ooh, Gold Duck. I haven't seen one of them yet. So Gold Ducks are water psychics. Those are cool. 
I wouldn't mind there being a starter that's a water psychic. Has there ever been a starter that had any psychic? I don't think so. I really don't. Unless it's like in one of the new ones that I'm just not aware of. Well, no, because in, um, uh, uh, what am I thinking of here? In Alola versions, uh, Sun and Moon and whatnot, there's Water Fairy, I think Grass Ghost, and then Fire Dark or something like that. Um, is it fire fighting? I don't remember. Something like that. Um, but I don't think there's ever been a psychic starting. Unless it's in the Alola, not the Alola, um, Sword and Shield, which I have not played yet. So I don't know. I really, I don't know much about them. Okay. I'm going to save. And then next time, we're going to go fight this guy. Okay. See you guys later.